Serious question. Is Young Chop trying to turn himself into the new retro? Because cause, cause still the old 6 9 But anyway. The new retro 6 9 me and the notification gang would like to invite everybody to come join us Monday through Thursday, 9.20 to 10 o'clock for Morning Coffee, where we discuss the events of the prior day and also just talk mess about stuff. See you then. Oh, Black Dynamite, I wish it was that simple, but this is much bigger than you and me. Hey, little mama. It may be bigger than you, and it may be bigger than me, but it ain't bigger than you and me. Can you dig it? BBN, Jack Frost. What's up, party people? All right, so, yeah. So, apparently, Young Chop is beefing with, I guess at this point, you could call it, what you got. Because whatever you got, Young Chop is ready to beef with it. Okay, so, real quick, um, and I just want to throw this out right at the beginning of the video because I want to just say something that's a fact to me. To me, this seems like a fact. Um, young Chop, NBA young boy for reasons beyond his control, and Kodak Black has been in the media. Obviously, Kodak Black and NBA, and um, pardon me, um, Young Chop, they're in the media or in the news currently because of overt actions, because of things that they actually did themselves. NBA Youngboy, although, when he, you know, he's usually in the media, he's one of the biggest artists on the planet. Um, just so we could be clear, Kodak Black is a mega star, huge artist also, and Young Chop has worked with some of the best and made some great music. Just so we could be clear, these none of these guys are slouches. Alright, so, um, it seems to me like as soon as 6 9 was about to come out, everybody started finding a problem with everybody else. <laughs> Can we find out when Young Chop start talking crazy? Yo, real talk. It seems like as soon as Cool to Be was released and people started realizing Takashi's probably going to come home also, that's when the shenanigans started. I don't know what to tell you, but that's what it seems like to me. I could be wrong. Leave it down in the comment section. Let me know what y'all guys think about this. I mean, think about it. Think about back when Young Chop first, go back to his first post when he started talking beef. Was that around the time that Cool to Be got released? I'm just asking, what the hell do I know? Anyway, um, so Young Chop, <laughs> I don't know what to tell you about this guy. He was on his porch the other day shooting at people in cars. Now, at first, initially, when I saw the video, I was like, yo, somebody trying to run down on homie. He out there blasting on him. I was like, yeah, Young Chop, do your shit. You feel me? And then I thought about something for a second. I have no idea where Young Chop lives. Was that a road? <laughs> Is it just cars that's driving down the road and Young Chop is like, nah, nigga. Like, what is going on? And forget whether that's a road or not. I would hate to think that somebody made a wrong turn and then got their life scared shitless out of them by somebody shooting a gun at them. I've had to ask people for directions before in the middle of the night. I used to drive trucks for a living. I've had to ask people for directions in the middle of the night. I'm just fortunate none of them was Young Chop. Anyway, um... Um, just I'm making jokes and everything, but Young Chop actually has been beefing with a lot of people and saying some really, really slanderous, uh, making some really, really um, salacious accusations. Accusations. So I, I wouldn't be surprised if there were some people that were mad at him and wanted to, you know, do something. I believe it was French Montana that said that, you know, he was like, "Yo, somebody come get your boy, man. Cause something gonna happen to him." I think it was French Montana that was saying that. I'm not a hundred percent sure, but. No, I am 100% sure. I'm just I'm just saying it like I'm not 100% sure, but I know it was French Montana that said that. So, um, the point being is, Young Chop lives, he's from Chicago. He currently now lives in Atlanta. For whatever the reason is, he's beefing with some chick too. Like, there's some broad. I don't know her name. <laughs> I don't know why I use the word broad. There's some chick. I don't know her name, Um, but, but Young Chop is also beefing with her. So, Young, like I said, Young Chop is just right now, Young Chop is like, yo, what do you got? <laughs> like, yeah, I'm hungry, man. I want this beef. What do you got? That's what young chop when young chop is at right now. Other than that, I don't know what to tell you. So, um, there's some chick that young chop is beefing with, 
and apparently she said something about selling her soul to the devil or some shit. I don't I don't know nothing about that. Perfectly honest, I think she makes music. I think her name is Suki. Um, her IG says Suki the Good Coochie. Oh man, really, baby girl. This is how we giving it up. Anyway, um, shit, she's followed by some big names, and she's also. It seems a verified account with over 800,000 followers, so she is not a nobody. So the point in which I'm trying to make is, is that at this point, Young Chop is just beefing with everybody. He's even beefing with women. I have no idea why he's going this route. I don't know why he's so angry. Somebody made a joke a while back and said that he smoked some bad, he smoked a bad blunt. Somebody put something in his smoke or some shit. Um, at this point, I'm starting to believe him. Because I don't see any reason for him to be beefing He started beefing I think his album dropped And now he's just still beefing So Young Chop Look man I'm just saying this As a YouTube content creator As a father And as a current occupant Of the planet Earth Homie It's not that serious Like comment subscribe join the notification gang hashtag bronx bombers let's get it i love y'all take care of each other hug the kids for me i haven't forgotten about you and that's all i got on this one i'm out Some say that it might look easy Come take a walk in my shoes and you rethink things Practice makes perfect, that's the reason why my flow mean I'm the rose that sprouted through the concrete I learn from the best, don't sweat the technique Shall I proceed? I'm a slap fiend Music is my focus, that's my only option Money motivation is the only thing popping. Talking business with the higher reps and the Cochrans In the shark tank, I'm weighing my options Throw the hook with the bait on it They throwing numbers at me now, we gonna debate on it Business is good, I put my faith on it Pay my tithes in church and I keep on going Jumping something foreign, now I'm UFOing My name is Slap Fiend, y'all keep calling me Slap Phone What the hell is this, homie? Yo, this is crazy. I don't know where I'm going with this. I mean, like, when I started off making the beat, I was like, man, I, I had something in my mind that I was thinking, but I, I just couldn't get it to come out. So, you know, I'm looking at the monitors looking crazy. <laughs> I'm like, shit. Yo, X, turn me up a little bit, fam. I got you, Slap. I want them to hear this one. Come on, you already know. Slap fee, slap fee, slap fee. Some say that it might feel strange. Once you make it to the top, it all change. Nothing is for free, you have to gather up the change. Life's obstacles, and ours remain the same. I walk a thin line like a resident in Cuba. And shouts out to the refugees, I ain't talking about the Fujis. Hashtag no subliminals, we are the movement. Shouts out to the future, y'all the core of the movement. Tim the tool man, Taylor showing home improvement. My talent stays structured, you can hear it through my music. Music, conceptual art is what I'm doing Abstract minded, I done came from the ruins Battle scars shown, I get down in what I'm doing I gave a rat's ass on how you spend your cash fast How much paid, bills paid, this is how I live my life And if I can do it, I live life twice I don't know where I'm going with this Met a crossroads I don't know where I'm going with this Need a sign to tell me which way is right I don't know where I'm going with this. I'm lost, I'm lost. I can't find my way. Help me. I need a sign today. I need something. Lord, I need something. If you like this video, please hit the like and subscribe button. If you would like to help dictate the direction that this channel takes, please leave a comment. All comments are appreciated, whether positive or negative. Thank you very much and enjoy your day. And remember, positive thoughts cause for positive things to happen. Let's get it.
Oh, Black Dynamite, I wish it was that simple, but this is much bigger than you and me. Hey, little mama. It may be bigger than you, and it may be bigger than me, but it ain't bigger than you and me. Can you dig it?